Lance and Christy. Join us as we build our dream. Welcome to Knight's Helm Farms. And just like that, it's cold outside. Huh? I said, and just like that, it's cold outside. It's only like 50 something. 50. So he is putting up the second to last piece. This is the last full sheet. And then there'll be like a half sheet up here. We've had rain. It's just been crazy. Crazy rain. And now it's cold. It looks like it could go that way just a like a quarter, a sixteenth, an eighth. Uh, there you go. See, she's talking to me in the kitchen. And Hi, Arthur. <laughs> we come outside and all the cats go crazy. Uh -huh. How are you going to get that? There's not enough room for you to go up in there. Oh, but you can reach over. Oh, I see. Oh, I get it. We had more warping, too. Did you notice? Uh -uh. So this one is no longer straight. It leans in. How but to do that when we had it I know, sure. but it can't go any farther now. And then a couple of these along the wall have kind of bowed out. Yeah, that one did. It's weird. But it is what it is. See along the wall. The farthest one is the worst down there. No, it was straight at one point. Yeah, but how does it go? Oh, that one? Yeah. Yeah. There's no way. Yeah, I don't know. I noticed this morning that it's leaned in. Look at Arthur watching the dogs. They can't get you. They're being so rowdy right now. You're fine, yeah. Arthur. You're fine, Arthur. They can't get you. <laughs> They're in a paddock. Anyway. You can move all that if you need to. I can move it for you. Okay. So we've got a sheet and a half. And then we went yesterday, got the lumber that we need in order to enclose this. This area. It's not a lot of lumber. The majority of it is hardware cloth. And we ordered five foot hardware cloth. So there won't be any seams. Can I help you? Nope. Okay. Oh, you're trying to get that off. Do you need the plus sign? I'll just try to get that out of my way. We just put that up there to see where we need to cut it and it's exactly half. That turned out good. Yep. Where are you going to cut it? I already did. On the trailer? Yeah, probably so. Okay. You could 
see uh, how worn down the blade gets on this. <laughs> Do you have your safety glasses? I'll go grab them for you. A sheet. Yep. Woo. 3D. <laughs> awesome. I don't know if you can see the end, but what he was able to do was cut it so that we have the center V. So it's a 3V panel, basically. <laughs> and then it's going to go over the one of the um, two Vs on the previous side. Uh, I hope that makes sense. So that's kind of cool. It's going to all line up that way. And then, scrutle it. Um, wow. As far as length, it's right there, but I think it has to go toward the edge. Oh, maybe not. Maybe it's just up in the air. Yeah. I think it's fine. Okay. Yeah, for some reason, we're somewhat crooked here. It's lined up there, fine. Yeah. It sticks out over here a ways. Why? Oh, well, because the other side is the opposite way. Yeah. <laughs> That's why. Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. Screws it down. Here, I'll give you your... You have... You have... Um, screws? I got... No. You don't have any? I don't have any. All right. Well, this would be easier for me to hand it to you from up there anyway. Hand it to you. Mm 
Lucky rolled in, but his face is all green and he smells like cow poop. So, you know, probably cow poop. Now you're gonna do the ends right from out yeah. here. Yep. Monkey man, don't forget your drill. You want me to come grab it for me? <laughs> Monkey man. Here. Give me the drill. Okay. Yay. I know the cats have been enjoying it. We've had all that rain and they've been high and dry yep. on the back deck with the gates closed and nothing can get them. Yep. <laughs> the other day you were doing really good because you got used to it. Now today you're all frozen. I think I'm too close, that's why. You're all frozen again. I can get out through the ways. I thought you had the letter straight doing it. What, straight forward? No, like like the other letter is straight. No. Not in a bin. Nope. Definitely not. Hmm. Danger, Will Robinson. Danger. The replay of the where to put the ladder because you have to be able to reach and you don't want to fall. Right. And you need leverage. Yep. Can you go up one more step? Uh, maybe. What's wrong? This again. Crooked. Crooked. Okay. Maybe this is the right one. You made it. Yep, I'm up here. You're up there. There's your drill. How many screws you got to put in? Quite a few.
when we take that. I'll take it down far enough for you to get to it. Oh, are you making a short joke? Well, I am like, what, 10 feet up in the air? What? Let's see how you could possibly get it. I have extremely long arms. <laughs> I have a four foot body and six foot long arms. Look, I can reach pretty high. Uh-huh. See? Yeah. That would be the right about here. I'm yeah. Like. Yeah, because you're so tall. No, because I was up there. My God. Look, look. Uh-huh. Put your hand up. Yeah, you're tall. <laughs> no fair. What? No. We already knew that. No fair! Uh, All right. Snow fair. Now what? It's no fair. Well, now I gotta put those other things on, right? With much deliberation. On there? Yeah, it's on there. Right. So then we're gonna need a hook out there, I suppose. Yeah. the panel way out here on the end and then hung all the lights up underneath and now we're going to that side to do the same thing hi Arthur how are you how are you really it's a nice day huh not too hot. Temperature's only half of what it was two months ago. 54 instead of 108. <laughs> Alright, I think we got it figured out. It looks good. Yeah, probably. I can put hooks in the middle. Yeah, just put them on the, put them on the r rafter and then right loop them up. Yeah. yeah. And that sucks them up a little bit. Suck it up. You can just use tiny ones, huh? Yeah. Yeah. Got the last of the roof on, which is amazing. Oh, amazing. So now it was that, I'm trying to remember how it was, that and this. 
that wasn't there. A sheet and a half, so it's like three feet worth. And then we got the solar panel or the solar collectors up on that end of the roof so that they could still collect solar. Running over here, brought the lights in and across. And he tacked them up with hooks in the middle too so that they're not droopy at all. And then with this one had to stop here because this is where the partition wall is going to go. So we had one extra light bulb. So we pulled that out this way. And then the second set ends here and zigzags all the way back to the first corner. And then goes up there and then that panel is on the upper side of that so it looks really good they're higher than they used to be kind of tucked up on the rafters a little bit and now the whole roof is done what do you think Saf? what do you think dirty dog they were out in the paddock playing and they got mud on their nose and somebody was digging a hole look at their white feet they're not white yeah. Mm-hmm. <laughs> and all the kitties are enjoying their blankets because it's cold at nighttime. So we put blankets out for them. But we're getting ready to go feed cats. And uh, most of the chickens have gone to bed. It's just kind of chilly. Chilly and dark. So there you can see the solar panel there and the other one right there and those pretty girls look at those pretty girls oh my goodness look at those pretty girls so that's it for today we have we still have to put the end caps on but I think the end caps that we have are the wrong ones they're not big enough so we're gonna get bigger ones put those on and then we have to put uh, gutters on this baby so that fascia board will be covered mostly with a gutter and then cup hooks for Christmas lights and then Christmas lights tis the season huh Pippin yeah yeah if we have more roof line we got, got we gotta have more Christmas lights <laughs> and then the whole enclosure thing and we have all the wood for that. And we have, I've ordered five foot, um, five foot tall hardware cloth. And I think this is 70 feet of five foot. So there won't be any seams in it. We won't have to put extra boards where two pieces come together or anything. It's gonna just go all the way across, so. That's pretty awesome. Whoop. Up close and personal with Mr. Pippin. Right, Artie? Can you say bye? Can you say bye? Nobody wants to say goodbye. Bye. We're gonna feed you dinner here in a minute. We're just putting the tools away. Yeah. Yeah. The girls played all day, ran all day. So. <laughs> There's our newest addition. He found us. We call him Ghost. White with blue eyes. Not completely deaf, but not not exactly 100% hearing either. So. Anyway, we'll call it a day. See you on the next one.